Hello everyone, I'm Trey Wittish. Here's your entertainment report for Monday, August 16th. Details about the upcoming Bruce Springsteen documentary about the making of his 1978 landmark Darkness on the Edge of Town album have been revealed. The film, which will premiere at the Toronto Film Festival in September and screen on HBO in October, will include exclusive footage of Springsteen and his band in the studio recording the album. The flick will also feature band interviews and even an interview with Patti Smith, who co-wrote Because the Night with the Boss. Sylvester Stallone's The Expendables dominated the box office this weekend, raking in $35 million. The action flick bested second place Eat, Pray, Love, which took in $23.7 million in its debut weekend. Not faring as well was the highly anticipated Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, which grossed only $10.5 million. Jennifer Aniston is shot back at Bill O'Reilly, who recently criticized the actress for comments saying that women don't need a man to raise a child. After O'Reilly called the comments destructive to our society, Aniston defended the comments, saying that the ideal scenario might include two parents, but that she was glad that science provided other options for those who hadn't found their Bill O'Reilly. An actress, Zhao Zhao Gabor, called a priest to her hospital bed on Sunday night to give her last rites, according to reports. The 93-year-old actress is reportedly in very serious condition at the UCLA Medical Center. Gabor has been in and out of the hospital since falling out of bed and breaking her hip on July 17th. She was rushed to the hospital late last Friday to have a blood clot removed. And that's your entertainment report for Monday, August 16th. I'm Trey Wittish. Be sure to stay logged on to rttnews.com for all your entertainment headlines.